Hey guys, this is Sunspan with an intro on Broodmother. Broodmother is a very solo dependent hero that requires a lot of attention or else she can take over the game. Spawn Spiderlings is her first skill and it starts out as a generic 300 damage nuke, but if the enemy you are using on dies within 2 seconds of it being used, they'll spawn into 3 Spiderlings at level 4. These Spiderlings are very cuddly creatures to the naked eye but are able to be controlled by Broodmother and therefore can be very deadly creatures. If the Spiderlings kill any unit, they'll turn into Spiderites, which are less powerful versions of the Spiderlings. As you can imagine, you can create quite an army with these, which can then be used to jungle or push towers. Spin Web creates an indestructible web in a target location. These webs last forever, but you can only have up to 8 at one time at level 4. These webs give Broodmother plus 8 health regeneration, plus 35% move speed, and invisibility. All these buffs work on Spiderlings as well. Incapacitating Bite is a passive orb skill that places a debuff on enemies when you auto attack them. At level 4, they'll have 25% chance to miss, have 40% slowed movement speed, as well as adding 8 damage. All of this lasts 2 seconds unless you reapply the debuff. It's very important to note that the 25% miss also stacks with other dodge mechanics in the game and Broodmother's ultimate's named Insatiable Hunger, and it's an absolute beastly ultimate that at level 3 allows Broodmother to deal plus 100 bonus damage and have 80% lifesteal for a 14 second period. This is yet another ability that stacks, this time with lifesteal items. Thanks for listening guys, and as always remember to subscribe to Dota Cinema, your home for Dota 2 videos, and also check out Dota2Portal.org as well as DotaReplays.org. My name is Sunspan, and until next time...